Hello, what's up? House of Kicks here again. And uh, if you were watching my video last week, I talked about uh, those fake and replica shoes and where the sellers get it from on Taobao and some on, on, on the Chinese websites that I gave. All right, so now today I wanted to focus on one thing, uh, which is the Air Jordan 12s and if you know, three of them are coming out this year, and then two of them came out last year, the Drake or the OVO 12 or OVO 12s, whatever name you want to use. So I want to show you what they look like. So before you buy something online, you can kind of look and, and check to see if those are legit or not, all right? I'm not doing a real versus fake. You can go on Fake Education on Instagram and watch his stuff because he does a phenomenal job. And you can watch these things and, and then go from there. My thing is, I don't want you to go online and, and buy from a buy, uh, a seller. And then you buy it and four or five months down the line, you realize you bought a fake shoes. When you could have avoided all that by just looking at a video and see, okay, this is exactly like what uh, House of Kicks shared on his YouTube. So I'm not going to waste my money. Okay, so it's pretty much just a, a preventive method. And I'm just trying to share it with you, okay? And one thing I want to say, if you don't understand what I'm saying, uh, please ask questions. I'm here to help. All right, let's get into it. I will start off with a French Blue 12 right here. So when I click on it, now I chose this seller because his pictures were more clear and so you can kind of see more details on the shoe. Now he's selling these for 528 Chinese yen which is probably 110 or 120, all right? And he's gonna turn around, somebody's gonna buy these and then turn around and put it on eBay and sell it for like 250 or, or even $300. And someone is gonna take advantage of, he's gonna be taking advantage of because he doesn't know what he's doing, all right? So you have to be very careful when you buy online and really trust your seller. Now here's the thing, let me get to the shoe. Now you can see right off the bat, look at uh, the top here, next to the sock liner. It's not even even. So right off the bat, you know this is not legit, all right? I know sometimes uh, even Jordan brand shoes don't look that, that nice. So, But uh, it's just one thing that you have to look at. Okay, let me look at all the pictures. All right, that's the back. And sometimes the jump man is one thing that you have to look at and the stitches and the stitching or whatever. And the back, sometimes the position of these is, is sometimes might be lower, higher. Look at fake education, he has stuff like this. So I'm just trying to show you what the, the fake looks like. So when you buy online, if you see something that looks just like these, do not buy, all right? And sometimes one of the places that you have to look at is this side here too, especially on 12s. The fake one, they tend to mess up and, and, and the back type too get to be sometimes a little bit crooked. All right. But the most important thing now will be also sometimes the insole is flimsy. All right. And the sock liner here, uh, these doesn't overlap half of the time with the fake ones. You see here, it doesn't really overlap. You're supposed to be covering it this way and it's not doing that over there. And sometimes inside, if you look at the stitching, they use a the, the different thread, all right? And, and sometimes there's a stamp number here that may not or may be there. So that's just some of the things that you have to look at. All right, again, toe box sometimes is a little bit weird on the, on the fake ones. And it seems to be okay to me, all right? Now, the production date and the inside label. Now, sometimes you have to look at the inside as well because the material that they use here may not be the same, all right? This is a little bit too fuzzy. Now, look, this was produced in October of 2015, and these shoes here, the French Blue 12, is coming out in March. That's a little too early. I know sometimes Nike makes shoes very early, but this to me is a little too early. And so look at the date, all right? Produced on, it, uh, on, 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 the, on in October, between October and December. Okay, so if you see any shoes on eBay, Amazon, Kixify, or any website that has the same 
inside label like this one, stay away from it. Do not buy. Very simple. Don't know waste your money. All right. Now let me get to something else. I'm gonna X out of this, and I'm gonna look at uh, the bread or uh, flu game twelve. Some people say. Again, the price is the same, about 528 Chinese yen, which is about 120, 110. And he has full size rhyme. So your, your seller is going to buy this here and resell it for a lot more. And then you don't know what you're doing. And you go online, you think, oh, I have a great deal. And you spend your money. And then four or five months down the line, you realize I bought some fake shoes. Okay? Now, my problem is this. If you're going to sell these kind of shoes, if you're a seller and you want to sell this, let your buyer know, okay, this is not legit. So at least you're being honest about it. All right? Now, again, sometimes the glue, the glue mark, you can see that the, the shoes smell pretty bad sometimes. Now, this one, the top here is pretty nice. Okay, the back top, I mean, looks okay to me. Overall, looks fine. Okay? Back here, again, looks usually at the position of the 23, the, the jump band, sometimes the Jordan is not written right. And some of the things that you got to look at. Now, I'm just trying to show you what the fake is looking like. So when you go online, if it looks just like this one, do not buy it. Or at least let your, your, your seller know you know they're selling fakes. Now, here you can see this, okay? And then we're going to take a look at... Uh, production again look at uh, the, the sock liner and the tongue here this doesn't really overlap and the jump man might be different I'm not sure because I have not seen an authentic pair to do a real versus fake again this is preventive just don't spend your money just wait be patient insoles might be flimsy thread here and the inside of the shoe now the production this was produced in October again between October and January and these shoes do not come out till May all right so if you see somebody selling it and you see this inside label ask him ask him question I want to see the inside label what does it look like if you see this stay away you've learned your lesson do not waste your money and now the the box I really like how they went back with those original boxes from 1996 this looks pretty cool Okay, they even got everything right now, man. This is crazy. I'm going to X out of this again, and then I'm going to go to the this one here. This one's supposed to come out um in February, this month. All right, so be careful. So if you see somebody that carries these, now look at this here. This is too bulky. The top here is a little crooked. It's not well done. Let's look at all these, all right? Again, there's too many creases here. Look at all the creases. Right off the bat, you know this is this is hot. This is not a good shoe, all right. And look, doesn't overlap really well. And the back, I've not seen an authentic pair again. I'm just based based on my just eye, just looking at it, and and then taking my, you know, my expertise, if you want to say that. <laughs> but look, crease here again, back tab. This is not too even. Look at how it is. All right. And sometimes the holes also looks a little weird. All right. Your thread, glue marks. Those are the things, indicators. Inside, this is a little too flimsy again. I didn't touch what I could see. All right. And then the production. This was produced in July of last year, between July and October. And the shoes it wasn't supposed to come out till like now, which is February. All right. So do the math. If you see someone, again, ask for these kind of pictures. If you see these somewhere, don't buy because most of the fakes come out from the same place. They come out from the same factory. So when you produce them, they see them, and then when people talk, they might change it. But just be careful and ask questions. All right? This is it here. Now, this Ovo 12, or Drake 12, which I'm not really fond of, I mean... His shoes were super limited. This dude has a whole bunch of them. 650 yen, maybe 130, 140. All right? Now, look. Now, I saw a pair of 12 over on eBay. Let's look. And this guy is selling for $8,000 here, right? This is Cool Shoe Shine. He sells legit shoes. Now, let's look at the back here. You see how he's slanted? You see that? It's 
it's going like this all right now let's look at these guys now you see it's not the same all right it's more like a line it's not it's a little too vertical see and look even the the this right here it's not the same as that one look it doesn't look quite the same all right let's look at it back Okay, you see, that's not the same. When I look here, it's not the same at all. It is not the same. It looks like they drew on it. It doesn't even look like it, it's really a print. It looks like somebody drew on this here. Again, I, the lining here. Let's look the, the the placement on the holes. Might be too high here. Let's see if it's, see? It's not the same. You see, the hole is closer. And you see how this is well lined up? Not like that here, and the color is not the same. And let's look at the inside. See, this is too flimsy here. Nine and a half. See, and look, this is saying it's even saying sample. All right. Now let's look at the inside of the t uh, the inside label of this one. See, the board, the print is more is more bold, and look how firm this is in here. Look, look at the inside, the sock line. Look at that. All right, let's look at his. See, it's not the same. It doesn't look the same. See how bold this is? Bold, bold letters, smaller but bold. All right, let's look at this one. See, so if you see somebody look, selling these for too cheap, don't mess with it. Okay? Now let's go on eBay. And somebody else was selling them here. This guy is selling them for like $5.99. Sold 13 pairs. And look, you see the back? Now that's slanted. Now if you see this on eBay, do not buy it. 13 people bought it and they spent $600. And this dude, I bet you, paid how much? 650 Chinese yen, which is about 130 maybe. And now he's selling them for this much on eBay. And claims that these are samples and they're not in stores. So watch out when you buy stuff online. You don't want to go out there and waste your money. You know? At least if you know they're fake and you buy them, that's on your own. All right, let's look at the, the, the black one again. That's another one that's super exclusive. And they already have it here again, the back of it. The black one seems to look a little bit better than the, the other one. But these again are fake. Okay, I'm just going through real quick. All right. See, you see the letters here again, same, all right, samples and all that. So if you see these and you see somebody selling them, make sure you take this and you compare it. If it looks like this, don't buy it. If it's too cheap, don't waste your money. Now, this is not the only place where you can find these kind of shoes. Now, some of the sellers, like on kickstore.com, he sells it straight to uh, U.S., buyers all right let me just focus on the 12 today okay he has the bread for 180 oval for for 191 191 and he even has the hawks 12 for 200 bucks and somebody's gonna buy this and claim he has the plug he buys it and sell it to you and you waste your money and you find out they are fake and it's just you don't want to go through all that so just be careful so that's all I want to talk about today is those 12. So again, before you buy a shoe online, ask for inside pictures, the tags, and if you compare it and you see what I showed you today, then do not waste your money on it. Do not buy it. And if you have any questions, let me know and go on HouseOfKicks.com. Stay tuned for more stuff. Thank you for watching.